The FA-18 Super Hornet is actually a derivative of the FA-18 Hornet. It was developed in the 1980s to meet the US Navy's need for a more capable and versatile fighter aircraft. The Super Hornet is larger and heavier than the Hornet, and it has a more powerful engine. It also has a longer range and greater payload capacity. The FA-18 Super Hornet is the most widely used strike aircraft in the US Navy. It has been deployed in combat in Afghanistan, Iraq, and Libya. It has also been used in a number of humanitarian missions, such as the relief effort after the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami. The FA-18 Super Hornet is a highly maneuverable aircraft. It has a good thrust-to-weight ratio and a digital fly-by-wire control system. This allows it to perform a variety of high-G maneuvers, such as the Pugachev's Cobra. The FA-18 Super Hornet is a multirole aircraft. It can be used for air-to-air -air combat, air-to-ground combat, and electronic warfare. It is also capable of carrying a variety of weapons, including air-to-air -air missiles, air-to-ground missiles, and bombs. The FA-18 Super Hornet is a very reliable aircraft. It has a low accident rate and has been praised by pilots for its ease of maintenance. It is expected to remain in service with the US Navy until the 2030s. Here are some additional things you might not know about the FA-18 Super Hornet. The Super Hornet can carry up to 17,000 pounds of weapons and fuel. It has a top speed of Mach 1.8, 1,190 miles per hour. The Super Hornet is equipped with a variety of sensors, including radar, infrared sensors, and electronic warfare systems. It can be refueled in mid-air. The Super Hornet is a very expensive aircraft. The cost of a new Super Hornet is about $70 million. The FA-18 Super Hornet is a highly capable and versatile aircraft that has been used extensively in combat. It is expected to remain in service with the US Navy for many years to come.